Hey Cancer, so as you know, my name is Kianti Ashe and this is Blue Aura Healing Guidance and Tarot. This is going to be a general reading for all of our Cancers, okay? So Cancer Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, Mars, or North Node, it really doesn't matter, love. If you in any way at all identify as a Cancer, then this reading is for you. Now here's the thing, y'all. If you're new here, yes, I understand there are way more placements than those that I mentioned. However, that is the way that I say my opening. That is how I do my thing and have done so for years. Okay, I just love my opening. So I stick with my opening because it's for all signs. It kind of just flows together. You all kind of made my little song. You feel me? My little poem, my little sonnet, whatever you want to call it. And I just flow with it. Okay, so yes, we know there are more placements and I do mean all placements okay that's just the way that i open up the videos okay so that's just what i wanted to let you know because i feel like i have to if i ever say something during the reading it's because maybe i picked up on the energy or something someone's gonna be like well maybe it's not for me because i'm not a, a cancer placement that she mentioned i'm a cancer this and she didn't mention it nope it's for all placements okay so you too boo you too all right now i had to clear that space out let us see what the messages are for our cancers. Thank you, Spirit. What are the messages? Shout out to all my early risers. <laughs> We have barrel, all right? It says, you feel something is lacking in your life, perhaps love, money, or goals, all right? So something is lacking, okay? Or that's how you feel, anyway. We have key, all right? Successful outcome to your problems. You will be overcoming whatever this is that you feel right now. I feel like it's temporary. Excuse me. We have crown. Excuse me. Honor and respect will come to you, Okay. Flowers, happiness, beautiful, mountain, major challenge to overcome, but nothing to a G, of course. And we have casket, someone going out of your life or the end of a situation. I really feel like this is the end of any difficulties, burdens, hardships, whatever the case may be. I feel like if somebody or something tried to pose a threat to you, then that situation is over, it's done. You can expect success. You can expect honor, respect praise all right several different things coming to you because of the way that you handle situations or the way that you carry yourself and y'all already know i'm freaking with the cancerian energy right now hard body like hard body okay so let us see messages here for our cancers we have official person all right so yeah you guys are official you're official tissue but i also feel like some of you could have been going through something with child or children all right somebody here could have been trying to get their child back not going to resonate with everybody but it's somebody's message congratulations you're going to be getting your child back all right yeah because you have stability in your life now okay that's all you needed you needed a stable place um to call home you know a good environment for them you have turned your life around in a very very major way way all right spirit has blessed you and your family and i mean this from the bottom of my heart congratulations okay you deserve this so just go ahead and expect it with expectation coming out here there's another card we have pathway like i said spirit made a way out of no way if it's one thing god is is going to do okay is make a way you understand me we have gift here all right so this is your gift from the universe amen blessed be and it is so okay so yeah we have the ace of swords we have the four of wands so you're being blessed with clear sight vision precision um genuine relationships and stability okay you're being set free from any obstacles or worries or concerns that you may have had okay beautiful energy All right, let us see. All right, so we have the tower here, okay? So the tower talks about something coming unexpectedly, but like I said, you can go ahead and expect it, all right? I feel like even though you expect it because you've been doing all of the right things, it's still going to surprise the heck out of you, you know, to a pinnacle because you like, I really got my ish together. I really got my life together. Yes, you did. Go you. We got the Ace of Wands. Yes, you took your power back. Some of you could have had addictions that you really struggled with for a very long time. You struggled with that addiction. You got over that addiction. And now look at you on the other side. We have the Three of Wands here. You can expect this to come in the very near future. All right. You being viewed as a homemaker. All right. As somebody who built 
a stable environment like i said okay so i'm very proud of you the energy that's coming through here whoever you were you struggled for real and you finally overcame that struggle so we have the seven of cups here all right i feel like now you have lots of options lots of doors open up to you here all right notice i said doors open up to you and you guys have the key all right so go figure all right i feel like somebody here um maybe knows a virgo taurus capricorn that virgo taurus capricorn is going to help you or assist you in some way that sounds a little bit familiar if i'm not mistaken i mentioned it in the last cancerian reading or the one before that but we have the wheel of fortune yes it's your turn to be at the top of the wheel okay it's your turn to um have luck and fortune be on your side okay we have the eight of cups here yes it's time for you to walk away or withdraw from anything that no longer serves you we have the ace of pentacles because your life is about to permanently change okay permanently our cancers we have temperance because it's divine timing okay it was always meant to happen exactly as it did you are the magician you realize that now that you can manifest whatever life that you want and because of this realization now you're bringing these things in okay so let us see here with this tower card spirit for our cancers oh okay cancer the magician what did i say it's going to shock you because here you are thinking that you're going to be getting a whole bunch of no's or you're going to get a whole bunch of duds when it comes to the things you're trying to manifest. But little did you know, manifestation is genuinely real. All it took was for you to believe in yourself and then whoop, there it was. And it's all because of, you get what I'm saying, someone around you. That's what it said. You get what I'm saying? So each one teach one, you know what I mean, type shit. Not like, oh, it's because of them that you have it, but it's because of them that you know that manifestation is real. All right. So we have two of pentacles here. We have the eight of pentacles. All right. So you you balance something out. You learn how to um, work on yourself as well as master some sort of skill or craft or something like that. All right. Possibly your intuition, because I saw the high priestess as the underlining. So knowing how to trust your intuition. We have the Ace of Wands. Okay. Let me see what this Ace of Wands is. For our cancers. We have the King of Wands. All right. Yeah, exactly. Realizing that the power is in your hands. Okay. So you took control of your life. That's what I'm getting. We got the Three of Wands. You wanted to see your life change, so you took it by... You know what I mean? We got the emperor here. Yeah. So discipline. Whole new job. Um, whole new uh, stable environment. Once again, with the emperor, because this is stability. This is discipline. This is structure. The death card, transformation, change, rebirth. Exactly. The end of a cycle. Like I said, lots of options now becoming available to you. It is your time to be at the top of the wheel. Okay. Seven of cups. Seven of Cups. Ooh, okay, we have the Queen of Pentacles. See what I'm saying? Virgo Taurus Capricorn, Two of Wands. Okay, and we have the Eight of Swords. Yeah, all right. So it's like some of you were stuck in your head once upon a time. See, Page of Cups, you were um, maybe younger or before. Okay, let's just say that when you were younger or you were inexperienced, you didn't know better. Five of Pentacles. Now you know better, you can do better. You learned some secrets, you learned some truth, you learned some hidden knowledge or something like that that helped you you know, get this key to open many, many doors for yourself. So we have the Wheel of Fortune here, okay? What is this? Wheel of Fortune, okay? We have the Three of Pentacles, yeah, all right? So like I said, you and someone else did this together, cooperation, teamwork, building yourself up. But once again, this is just having the necessary skill set within yourself, seeing yourself as capable, Queen of Cups. All right, to accomplish something, to get something done. Congratulations again, Four of Wands, okay? So if this was your reading or you enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. And if you have not already, go ahead and subscribe. Peace and hair grease.